With the Omicron variant spreading, hospitals and testing sites are struggling to keep up with high demand. ABC 10's Jay Kim explains how the governor's office is responding. This wave is nuts. COVID cases continue to soar across California. In Sacramento County, cases have recently spiked to an all-time high. And with the spread of the Omicron variant, testing sites around the state are overwhelmed. I've noticed that more appointments have been needed, not as many walk-ins, just because of the demand for testing right now. On Saturday, Governor Gavin Newsom's administration revealed a preview of Newsom's state budget proposal, which includes $2.7 billion to fight COVID-19, 1.4 of which is earmarked as emergency funds to be used immediately. The additional $1.3 billion would be used during the 2022-23 budget year. Well, I think this is exactly what needs to happen in every single street across the U.S. because if we do not put resources into our battle against COVID-19, resources for testing, resources for prevention, like updating the vaccine, and resources for treatment, we are going to start losing this battle again. Most of the funds would go towards increasing testing by expanding hours at testing sites and sending millions of rapid tests to local health departments, community clinics, and schools. Newsom's administration says funding would also go towards ramping up efforts to get more Californians vaccinated and fight misinformation about vaccines. The reason that people aren't vaccinated the biggest reason is misinformation. So combating misinformation, I think, is critical. In addition, Newsom's administration is calling for new legislation for new COVID sick pay that would require businesses with 26 or more workers to offer up to two weeks of additional paid sick leave for employees to take care of themselves or a sick family member. A previous pandemic sick leave policy expired in September. I literally got goosebumps hearing that because I think we have to take care of ourselves before we can take care of others, but also as people, we have to take care of ourselves. And Governor Newsom will unveil his complete budget proposal on Monday, where he'll discuss the state's economic growth. This comes one day after California is sending the National Guard. Governor Gavin Newsom activated more than 200 members to help with staffing and crowd controls at testing sites.